Hey, what's up? It's Josh Shanley, and I want to show you how you can use GetResponse to create really simple landing pages like the one on my screen right now that convert like crazy, right? Landing page, squeeze page, lead capture page, whatever you want to call it. This is a primary uh, cornerstone of building your business. In fact, uh, why we want to use these, I explain in a video that I'll let you know how you can get, uh, get for free at the end of this. Uh, but I explain how this is an integral part of the overall formula for building an online business. Okay, so, uh, but I I'm going to show you how you can do it so, so simple uh, with GetResponse, right? So, uh, with GetResponse, now they actually have this landing page generator, which is a, it's an add-on service. That's not what I'm talking about here. I'm talking about how you can build a web form that is a landing page like this. And in fact, uh, I'll probably put below this video the link to this page uh, because it's got the complete formula. Uh, I walk you through a complete formula that I personally have used to go from rock bottom to creating freedom and prosperity to working from home, right? Uh, for many, many years now. And this is a critical part of that formula. So let's show you how we can do it, right? So in GetResponse, oh, also, I'll, uh, I'll let you know that I'll probably also have a link below this where you can get a free trial account with GetResponse if you're not using them. It's what I use uh, to build my email list and it's what I recommend to others. Here's how we do it. We, uh, first of all, we have to log in. Then we go to Web Forms List, okay? Web Forms List, okay? And I'm actually going to switch the campaign I'm going to create a web form with. As you can see, I have lots of campaigns here. And we'll go with that one. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to create a new web form, right? Now, because this is on video, you know, I, I tend to go kind of fast. You'll be able to, you know, you can pause this, you can replay it, whatever. Uh, I like the plain Jane web form, so I choose that and I hit apply, okay? Now, when I do these, I typically only ask for email, right? Uh, why? Because we can get, typically I've found 25 to 50% more people will opt in uh, if, you, if you don't have the name field. So we're going to take that off. I'm going to slide this out. I'm going to stretch this out a little bit. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to create our headline. Now, for the sake of saving time, I'm just going to copy this one that I've already created and paste it here. Right? So that's step number one. Uh, I'm going to copy this and see if I can get it to spread out and little, look a little bit better. Sometimes this is a little wonky. It uh, looks like maybe it is a little bit better, but not a big deal either way. I'm going to hit apply. Uh, I think if we straight, there we go. Now we got it on two lines. I like that it's on two lines. And I'm going to, I'm going to edit this just because I'm a little bit, uh, sometimes I'm a little bit anal retentive on these. I'm going to change this. I'll, I'll, I'll bold it because that underline was like, I don't know. Uh, all right, we're going to change the uh, sign up to say watch video now. And then here's what I want to show you. Now, this is, a, this is a pretty neat little trick. One Actually, before I do that, I'm going to turn off the powered by get response. I'm going to leave the re respect your policy or your privacy, your policy. Um, and now I want to show you how you can add a video. You can do this. You can add a video. You can add an image. You can use, add anything that's HTML related. You could add a like button, okay? A like button on Facebook. You can add anything here. So let me let me click on this video, and let me get the embed code. Hey, what's up? My name is Josh Shanley, and uh, it was just a few short years ago. Okay, I'll grab the embed code. I'm going to go back over here. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add text, which creates a new text box here, right? I'm going to click on HTML, and I'll get a new window. Now, I want to center my video. So the the HTML for center is just this, what I'm doing on the screen. I don't even know, like less than, center, greater than. I think that's what it is. I'm going to paste in my, my code, uh, my YouTube code. And there's one thing I'm going to do to make the video autoplay at the end of this little string here. I'm going to add and autoplay equals one. And then I'm going to close out the center by, uh, I don't know, greater than or less than. I don't remember. <laughs> I never really was, I, I never could figure that out in school. Uh, forward slash center and then whatever, the, the other end. And then we're going to update. 
and we're going to apply. And then I'm going to slide this up. Now, it looks real big here. Okay, it looks real big here, but don't worry. Um, uh, it actually resizes. So the next step we're going to do, we're going to click next step. And now we choose where the person goes after they opt in, where the person goes after they opt in. Now, we could leave it at as default, which basically is just a message that says, hey, we've emailed you the information you've requested, yada, yada, yada. What I'm going to do, I'm going to go quick grab that video that I said you would get if you opt in. Because what I'm actually going to do, I'm going to put the link to what I just created below this video as a link that you can click on and you can get the formula that I am talking about, of which you know having a landing page is a, an integral part. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to grab my link there. Okay, I'm going to go over here and I'm going to switch to custom thank you and I'm going to paste that there. I'm going to hit next step. And now here's how uh, here's how we make this basically a landing page or a squeeze page, lead capture page, whatever you want to call it. Click on this button right here and now we've got this link that when we copy it and we paste it into our browser Boom, boom, how cool is that? Now, what I, what I would recommend that you do is that you create, you get a, you either get a, d a domain or you create a subdomain on a domain you already have that will redirect or forward to this because this is kind of ugly to be posting places, right? If you wanted to promote this, this capture page, this is kind of, you know, it's not the prettiest thing to be promoting, right? And so I'll do that. The link below this video, you'll see, it will be a subdomain uh, to this capture page, right? Really cool, right? Uh, and now here, here's the thing. If you're wondering, do these convert as well as like the fancy schmancy landing pages that you may see other people using? And the answer is in almost every case, yes. And in many cases, they convert better than some of the fancy schmancy. You know, that's the technical term, right? Uh, so go and do this, right? Below you'll get a you have a link to a free trial and get response. Uh, if you don't already have a get response account, there's a link to a walkthrough. I show you how this is a uh, an integral part of a, a bigger formula that you can use to create a profitable, predictable, and scalable online business. Right, and I'll give you that training for free. Powerful, powerful content. It's the exact formula that I've used uh, to go from, you know pretty rough place to, uh, uh, to to freedom and prosperity. So thanks for checking this out. I hope it was helpful. I hope you actually do this and use what this strategy because uh, it works like crazy and uh, will serve you really well. Thanks for the, checking this out. Again, it was Josh Shanley. Check out the links and resources below and uh, hopefully I'll see you on another video like this real soon.